Hello, this is Dean. I hope you're doing well. Welcome and a welcome back to my channel where you receive divine guidance and encouragement. To my current and new subscribers, thank you for your support. It is greatly appreciated. And if you are browsing YouTube and you've come across my channel, it is not by coincidence. This is a divine connection. So go ahead and press that subscribe button and join us here because I would love to have you. Also, I invite you to join me on Instagram at you are following D2. So this is a general reading for the collective, which may or may not resonate with you, which comes to you from the guardian angel cards. Now, if the message resonates with you, great. If it doesn't, just let it pass. In other words, take what resonates with you and leave the rest. So let's get to your message. And also, did you notice my nails, my nail color matches the cards? And no, I did not plan that. No, no, no. It's a synchronicity. Isn't that awesome? Don't you just love it? I love synchronicities. And for me, my nails being uh, polished with the pink, right? Which for me symbolizes love that reminds me of like the rose quartz love, that gentle, caring love that's um, primarily focused on self-love, right? And look, the, the cards are heart-shaped, right? So for me, I feel like it speaks to me to be reminded of how important it is to indulge in self-love. So yeah, I got all that from nail polish color that matched the cards. So I'm loving it. I'm loving it. So, okay. Anyway, let's get to your message. And nothing just happens. That's not a coincidence. It is not a coincidence. That's divine. So be aware of the colors that you, you know, not be aware, but be mindful. Like sometimes just pay attention to the colors you wear and see how the colors make you feel and or perhaps even research to see what the colors mean or just simply consider what you were thinking of when you decided to wear whatever color it is you know did the color make you feel um very happy did it um make you feel extremely confident etc cetera, etc cetera. all right Okay, so now let's get to your message. God, most high angel spirit, guides, beings of love and light, the Holy Spirit. What is the divine guidance and encouragement for the collective that's for their well-being? Okay, so you have creativity. And the message is this. We, your angelic messengers, are here to help unleash the endless creative potential that you possess. Listen to the whispers of love inside your heart as we communicate with you through feeling and emotion. Let go of fear and apprehension and express the endless source of creativity you possess have fun and allow the inner child within you to express your true essence all is valid so i'm not going to talk about how my nail polish matched this card <laughs> i'm not going to say nothing about that i'm not saying nothing okay i'm not saying nothing <laughs> but the message as you just heard is encouraging you to tap into your creative side and also be playful because you're being encouraged to have fun and allow your inner child to express itself. So know that all is valid. So if you feel like getting you some bubbles from 
the store and blowing bubbles, that is valid. Have fun. Um, if you feel like drawing or coloring, rather it's a standard um, child or young adult coloring book, or if you want to get an adult coloring book, use that to express your creativity. Paint, draw, sing, make up your own song. Um, sew, knit, crochet, um, write a poem, write a song. Um, whatever you desire, just allow your creative, your creativity and your creative juices to flow. Just let it flow and have fun, right? So like right now, I'm working on some Crocs that I purchased and I'm being creative with them. So I'm blinging them out. I'm just having a good time doing it. That's creativity that's flowing from within. And I'm having fun. It brings me joy. Like I've, I have one that's completely done and I'm working on the other one. So I'm saying that to say that I as well am being creative, right? And I've been working on my Crocs. Um, I'm busy, but anyway, I'm still doing working on my Crocs. <laughs> and it feels good to just be free to express my creativity. And the more creative we are, the more we are allowing ourselves to be open to receive divine guidance that really exceeds what we would expect, expect from God, creator, source, most high, the universe, however you see the higher power. But it helps us to really, really amplify our ability to embrace, trust, and trust our intuition and receive divine guidance um, that, again, exceeds our own expectations of what we will uh, be open be open to because using your creativity is just um, opening you up to be available to receive because it helps us to clear out like stuck energy if you follow me because when we're just using our creativity, we're just flowing, right? We're just flowing and just doing our thing, whatever it is, and enjoying it. And it brings peace and joy and happiness. And so what does that do? That raises our frequency, our vibration. It amplifies us to a higher level of, of joy and happiness and peace. That's where we want to be. We want to be vibing on a high frequency, which is joy, love, happiness, peace. So being creative helps us to get there and it allow us to just bask in that energy. And so as we do, of course, then we will begin to receive um, more, more clearer, guidance and we will also be um, in a place where we can receive openly from God creator source most high the universe without second guessing or um, having expectations having expectations that are lesser if you follow what I'm saying so I feel like as long as you allow yourself to have fun and go with the flow, you will see that things will change. You will see, you will feel the change around yourself, in yourself, and others will also see it and recognize it as well. So have fun. Be creative. I want to read this message once more to you. It says, we, your angelic messengers, are here to help you. 
unleash the endless creative potential that you possess. It's endless, endless creative potential. Listen to the whispers of love inside your heart as we communicate with you through feeling and emotion. Let go of fear and apprehension and express the endless source of creativity you possess. And I feel like for some of you, your creativity will open up doors of opportunity, which will also create a... Um, a stream of income for you. So let go of that fear. The fear based on what others have said to you, the fear of others not believing in your dream or not really supporting you. Well, it's your dream, it's not their dream. And if they're not supporting you, you can't let that be the thing that stop you or stand in your way. You have to go for your dreams. You can do it. No, literally, literally, you can do it. Just put aside the fear and push through it. Push through that fear. I challenge you to push through the fear. How do you push through it? By taking the appropriate action to go forward and create whatever it is that you want to. If you just want to have fun and chill and just feel good, then do that. But if you have a creative idea that has the potential to create for you a source of uh, income, a stream of income, I challenge you to go for it. Push through. And even if you just start by writing out your plan, that's an effort that you're making to face your fear and push forward to putting your full potential and full energy into manifesting whatever it is that you desire. You have you have angelic messengers that are supporting you. You have angels who are supporting you. And they, you know, they vibrate on a higher frequency, like they're vibing high. And because they're vibing high, of course, them helping you, assisting you, aiding you, is going to create abundance for you. It's going to create joy, happiness, peace. You're going to be fulfilled because they bring with them the energy that um, is for your well-being. It's going to help you to be happier, more joyful, more at peace, less stress. You follow me? Excellent. So allow your creativity to flow as I am. I'm allowing my creativity to flow because I just took some Crocs and I'm being creative with them, designing them. However, every, however, um, I'm led, you know, however I'm led, I'm just going with the flow and I encourage you to do the same. So I hope this message has been helpful. If you haven't already done so and you've made it this far, go ahead and press that subscribe button because I would love to have you join us here. Please like, comment, and share and leave me a pink heart emoji in the comment if this message resonated with you today or whenever you receive the message, all right? So take care of yourself. It has been a pleasure. And I can't wait to talk to you again. All right. Take care. Bye for now.